Welcome to the channel. Today we will see class 11 NCRT chapter number 8 binomial theorem exercise 8.1 expand first Roman 1 minus x 1 minus 2x whole power 5. So uh, definitely it is in the form of a 1 minus x whole power n. But here we have a 2x here we have x that is the difference. But 1 is their first term here 1 so that this formula is applicable only then nc0 minus nc1 x plus nc2 x square and so on plus minus 1 whole power n nc n x power n so this is the formula i'm going to use here okay but instead of x we need to substitute 2x understand now we'll go for this 1 minus 2x whole power 5 here n value is the 5 and x is the 2x okay now see this 5c0 minus 5c1 x in the sense 2x plus 5c2 x in the sense 2x whole power 2 okay this we need to continue until you will get that nc5 understand then next 5c3 2x whole power 3 plus 5c4 2x what is that uh, whole here power uh, what is that odd in the sense you will get here negative i forget this so please don't forget this one whole power 4 then minus 5c5 2x whole power 5 like that it will be ended when you get here 5 so both are the same now then you need to stop until the process will be continued understand like this you need to substitute now if you simplify this now you will get the answer understand now say this 5 c naught so c naught when you get uh, i what is that explained already about that things uh, or c whatever here c naught in the sense that is one likewise n c n which is also one means this both are if you have a same value now that is also one understand for remaining things uh, you have to use uh, ncr which is equal to n factorial divide r factorial into n minus r n what is that factorial this formula you have to use the combination formula from the 8th chapter already i explained about this in the previous video understand now we will substitute these things so 5 c not in the sense 1 minus so 5 c 1 here that is also i will explain you what is the listen carefully n c 1 in the sense here 1 we are getting now then what is the value here the same thing you will get n suppose 5c1 now you will get 5 100c1 now that is 100 like that okay so 5c1 now 5 into this 2x plus 5c2 in the sense that is i will explain here so 5c2 now I told you <coughs> 5 factorial divided 2 factorial into 5 minus 2 factorial like that you need to substitute now we'll go for this so 5 factorial now 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 <coughs> whole divide 2 into 1 if you subtract this 3 factorial then 3 into 2 into 1 now this 3 into 2 into 1 will cancel one time two time okay 5 2 is 10 that's it and then 5 c 2 now we are getting 10 so 10 into if you apply the power now 4 x square you will get so 4 x square understand now here minus is there so 5 c 3 in the sense again we will go for this 5 c 3 now 5 factorial whole divide 3 factorial into 5 minus 3 outside factorial now 5 factorial now 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1 <coughs> whole divide 3 into 2 into 1 5 minus 3 now 2 2 factorial in the sense 2 into 1 understand now 3 to 1 3 to 1 cancel 1 2 is 2 to 5 2 is 10 here also we are getting a 10 understand then 2 cube now 8 and x cube because the power is common for both number plus now we'll go for 5c4 so 5c4 we'll see here 5c4 in the sense 5 factorial whole divide 4 factorial into 5 minus 4 
factorial. Now simplify this. 5 into 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. 4 factorial now. 4 into 3 into 2 into 1. 5 minus 4, 1 factorial, then 1. Leave it. 4, 3, 2, 1. 4, 3, 2, 1. Then we are getting only 5. Okay. So 5 is 4 now. We are getting just 5. 2 power 4 in the sense is 16 x power 4 you will get understand and uh, minus 5 c 5 this both number same now you will get 1 so 1 into 2 power 5 in the sense is 32 and uh, x power 5 that's it if you uh, simplify this you will get the answer now see this 1 minus 5 2 is 10 x 40 x square minus 10 into 8 80 x cube plus 5 16 is our um, 80 you will get again 80 x power 4 minus 1 into 32 32 x power 5 that's it and this is our required answer i hope you'll understand this thank you thanks for watching this video subscribe for getting more videos and press the bell icon for getting notification